my campsite McKinney Falls and it's like freaking Blair Witch up here <laughs> it's so dark anyway I found my campsite I've got the fan on which is plugged into the Jackery and the Jackery is plugged into my 15 amp uh, which is then plugged in under the bed all the way over here to my adapter on the outside so it was $20 for the campsite it's a Thursday night so I was able to get a spot nothing this weekend but I'll be at Tiny Fest uh, this fan is amazing. It's battery powered and it plugs in uh, as well. And since uh, it has this like little adapter here, like a little plug right here, and it plugs right into the DC over here. And then the Jackery can plug in to this. My fridge is also plugged in. The fridge connector broke, so I need to get a new end for that, which is no big deal. Anyway, so yeah, <laughs> it's a little bit of calculation when you do van life totally safe nothing's gonna set on fire don't worry <laughs> so everything's grounded I have uh, rubber soles maybe not anyway this fan is amazing ten dollars from Walmart I've had this all through tent camping when I was in 100 degree weather it just feels so good and it cools everything down I also do have a crappy ceiling but I do have the max fan which I never use but if I want to I can always you know turn it on um, I just use it for ventilation um, but mostly I use this fan just to cool it down. I should be in the 50s tonight, so I should feel really good. So yeah, I'm glad I'm here. It's been a hell of a week. So I'm going to follow the golf cart, check in, and then park. I want to be next to the cool people. <laughs> so. So I checked in and it's the first time I get to put Prudence's name on something and they gave me this fancy sign. So this is the sign that you could actually choose face mark, sorry, face mask, mask, uh, required or optional. So I went with optional because anyway, <laughs> I'm not going to get into pandemic politics, but anyway, face mask, mask is optional. Just don't touch my stuff, cough on my stuff, get out of my van. <laughs> so it doesn't say like, you know, it doesn't say anything about me not telling people to get the hell out of my van. I'm just kidding. Um, no, this will be fun. And then they gave me this other thing. It's like max capacity, nine people. I don't really think nine people can fit in this van, but I'm going to make it happen. I mean, damn, I'm going to do one of those like phone booth things from like the fifties where they tried to get like 20 people in a phone booth. I'm going to fit nine people in my van. I'm going to get max capacity. All right, so I'm going to follow Caitlin, I guess, and uh, go find my spot. 
If you don't know your bovines, bovines, this is a Texas longhorn and this is quite possibly the biggest longhorn I have ever seen. That is beautiful. Look how beautiful you are. Oh my god. So you have the Highland cow or the Highland coo and you have the Texas longhorn and then you have the Locktons which are the four horned sheep. I think that you see in Isle of Man in England. You're beautiful. We try to aim for seven, you know? So, um, yeah, and Charlotte will kick it off for us tomorrow, you'll we'll see. So, um, I wanted to, I, of course, thank everybody for being here. I wanted to thank my team, but I'll do this tomorrow. But what I want to tell you is this is my brother. Turn around. Yeah. It's his birthday! Yeah. Unfortunately, the sun is like right there, um, but I'm behind the Poco Loco schoolie, so I'm gonna have to check them out. I'm gonna walk around and go meet everybody. I'm kind of over here on the edge, which is nice. I have a nice abandoned home that I'm next to. I've got um, afternoon sun right here. So in the morning, I'll get morning sun on the side of my van, excuse my wet clothes, the side of my van that the door is on so that I can have my solar panel the same side that I'll be standing so nobody like runs off with my solar panel. Anyway, so I'm gonna go walk around and go meet everybody. Everyone looks all like nice and clean because they all have showers in their van. So that Sprinter over there, you see that Sprinter, that Mercedes Sprinter, those are like, I don't know, like $97,000 like professionally built vans which are awesome. Mine, not a $97,000 professionally built van. Mine is uh, significantly less. Good morning from Tiny Fest. Uh, it's a very cold morning, it's in the 50s. And this is the first time using this 12 volt coffee pot or a teapot. It's just basically a hot water pot with a thermos and it fits in the uh, cup holder it's about 750 mils, so just less than a liter. And it probably takes about 20 minutes to heat up. Uh, looks like it's gonna stay pretty warm so I can have a cup of tea when I have basically a dead jackery right now because I don't have solar on my roof and I don't have like permanent electricity. So I just had to run the fridge last night, plugged into the jackery. Jackery as usual, always for me, it's zero in the morning 
and then usually when I'm driving I recharge the Jackery. Uh, today because I'm at Tiny Fest, as you can see I woke up next to a sea of van lifers, all different kinds of people. Uh, so um, that'll be super exciting today, um, but I do get to have a cup of tea in the morning, so that's good. And uh, yeah, so we'll see how well this does. Um, and then I'll turn the van off because right now it's running um, so I can uh, charge, I can use a 12 volt and then um, I will use my solar panels because I will get a lot of sun today and I'll see how long it takes to charge the battery. Right now the Jackery is at zero. Let's just see here. It's currently at zero but it should uh, charge up pretty quickly with the solar panels. Um, so the solar panels are right here behind my driver's seat and the tea is almost ready so excited for a cup of chai. <laughs> First time actually waking up with a dead jackery and no power having a cup of tea. Usually I have to go to a gas station or something but I can't leave the farm until tomorrow so I've got to make do with what I have and I'm so glad I bought this. You can get it on Amazon, I'll link it below. I think it was like 20 bucks or something. Uh, well worth it. <laughs> so I'm uh, super excited to have a cup of tea in the morning. today.
about this. So that is beautiful. Hi, you having fun? You gonna drive? Oh, that's what I need. <laughs> this is awesome. It's pretty awesome. It's like I'm getting some inspiration here. <laughs> right? Like inspired to get a bigger van. <laughs> that's super cool. A van before that, so it's uh, you know. a little bit more elbow room. Just a little yeah, bit. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Yeah. yeah, I think when the kids are grown, we'll probably go a little bit smaller. But I don't know if we could do a van. Just we need a little bit more. Like, I love the used size buses over here. Those are perfect. Yeah. 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 I mean, I guess I could I could definitely see going a little bit. It's really actually probably enough. Yeah. And it yeah. makes it easier to, like, park. Yeah, absolutely. And, like, we always make it work, but, yeah. yeah. It's definitely... Okay. That's the ending to my, uh, my video for the weekend, so... I got the money shot.